Hey, how you doing? This is Kitch, and you are watching me play Factorio. I didn't have these hooked up. Let's uh, go ahead and get these hooked up and make sure that we are making our low density structures so we can continue to, let's see, and that can be trimmed off. Um, Boy, yeah, I forgot about this stuff over here. Uh, we have all of this stuff backed up on the line. We haven't used nukes in forever. We haven't used... Boy, we definitely don't need that much uranium ammo. It seems stable, though. Um, I think we just leave it. No real reason to um, really do anything with it. Um, okay, you guys are all working now. You are. You take forever, but that is fine. Um, I think you're... Are you a little bit faster than 30 seconds? No, you're the exact same speed. Oh, well. Um, well, that's running now. We have our automated rocket launches working currently. Excellent. All right, so this episode, I want to do a couple of things. One of them was fix that. So we get our rocket launches going. But I also want to set up another station. So we've got our modules being made. And um, it's not perfect. It's not, not even, not even close. But it is currently working. I wish these would unload at a little bit better pace. Because right now, everything is completely unloaded except for this last car. Hmm. Yeah, it's just that they're unloading evenly, so this train is not going to get... I mean, I guess it's okay. I mean, while that's happening, uh, plastic is buffering up here. So, um, how much plastic do you have? 1,000. So, yeah, I mean, it's building up a little bit of buffer here, so it, it may not be that big of a deal. But uh, I think the bigger problem with this factory is that our green circuits just aren't aren't keeping up. I was looking earlier, and look, we've got chests here that are almost completely full of reds. We have more reds than we need. Well, that one has three. That one has 8.9k. I don't, I don't get that. That one has 9.6k. Yeah, these, these the, the, red, the red circuits are filling up. We have a abundance of those it's just greens maybe whenever i was laying this out i i it was three rows of greens and two rows of reds i don't know i'll, I'll have to go back to my spreadsheet and see how i messed up that calculation but i think we need to get some more green circuits up there but first what i'd like to do um and we we may need some of those later so i'm just going to create a new blueprint uh, i want to set up a new train station and to do that, I'm going to need to move this guy, our little train launch center. Um, it doesn't, it, it may not even need to be here anymore, really. But uh, even so, it doesn't, it needs to be moved over because we need to fit another station in here. And what I would like to do is set up a, basically another building train, really, is what it is. Um, we are full of stuff. Oh, we got a lot of garbage. Um, let's put... Put you guys in there. Um, trash, trash. Uh, we don't need all of this stuff either. Uh, guns, walls, radar. Anything else? Roboports. Big power poles. Little power poles. We only need to stack each of those. These can all go away. And these little guys right here. They'll come back if we need them. Alright, that looks a lot better. All right, do we have track? We have a little bit. Should be enough. Okay, how far can we take this over and still make that turn? Go back one? No. So that is as close as we can make it. I don't want to really move that storage facility. It's it's fine there. Oh, we've got a rock. Of course we have a rock. Why wouldn't we have a rock? Oh, come on, rail planner. Go through the rock. There we go. That's why I don't like... Yeah, that, that needs to go away. Works really well sometimes. It seems like most of the time it, it, it does that weird thing. Okay, so that, that'll be our station. 
Um, and it's pretty much going to be another building train with a little bit different purpose. This one, I want to set it up as kind of an automated building train. Because uh, what I want to do is have the ability to set down a blueprint. Is that lined up? I'm sorry. I know I'm like a, I'm like a, a dog here losing attention. Squirrel, squirrel. But yeah, got to get it. Um, yeah, I want the ability to set down to set down a blueprint, basically, and just have a train deliver the stuff and build everything for us. All right. Um, and we do have the building train, but it's more for specialized kind of stuff where uh, we are manually placing those things. I would like to have it where it just has the stuff we need for automated building. Um, I'm looking through the storage chests here for train cars. Not seeing them. We're going to have to build them ourselves. Um, I forget what those require. It's steel, iron, and gears. Oh, that's easy. Got steel right here. Got iron right here. Got gears right here. And we need four of those. And all the rest of this stuff can go back into the system. All right, so we're gonna have a train right here, and I think uh, I think four cars will be enough for it. We'll have three cars that have stuff in them, and it may may turn out to only be two, but four will definitely work. And the last one is going to be a trash car. Um, let's see. Go ahead and set that up. All right, and I mean it's gonna be very similar to our building train over here. It's not gonna be much different. Um, we're going to need, boy, I, I don't think I'm going to mess with the fast inserters anymore. I think we're just going to do stack inserters. Um, and, uh, let's see. We definitely want assembling machines. We definitely want modules. We want... We want chests. Okay, so I think, let's set... You to have modules and you to have these modules. And the reason why I'm picking that particular configuration is I think that speed modules are in the first station and production modules are in the second one. So that will work out good. Um, I think maybe just one row. I think that'll be fine. Uh, we are going to need some assembling machines. Let's get some of these in here. Maybe just a little nine block. Um, we are going to need beacons. That is for sure. Those logistics, they production. I guess they're production. And uh, we need probably a lot of those. So I'm just going to go ahead and fill that out mostly with beacons. Um, down here, we're going to need um, inserters. I think I'm just doing stacks. And we're going to need um, power poles. And might need substations. We'll throw some in there. And what else are we going to need? We're going to need chests. We're going to need robo-ports. I was thinking about making the last car there dedicated to robot stuff. Well, let's just take a look up here and see. Um, we may need... We may need things like um, refineries. Not really. I don't think we need refineries. I think we can handle that with hand building. We, we're not going to need very many refineries. How do I clear that out? There we go. Um, let's see. What else could we possibly need? Okay, let's go ahead and set up this down here. Uh, we are going to need storage.
storage chests, but not very many. We're going to need mostly passive provider chests. Wait, that's a lot of them. Uh, and a requester chests. Let's just do two rows. I don't think we need any active provider chess because I think I've seen the light on that one. Um, Roboports. And the rest of these can be dedicated to just logistics robots, I believe. That looks uh, reasonable to me. And um, we may we may find a need for some of this stuff. Uh, let's do something nutty, like cliff explosives. We don't have any of those being made, I don't believe. <laughs> we'll find out if we do. And uh, for you, yeah, the, the same. Cliff, cliff explosives, just to fill out that. And I think that'll be good for now. Let's take a look over here at the building train, just to check our work. Let's see what we have here. Construction robots, I don't think I'm going to take any of those with me. Got all that covered. Electric furnaces, don't think we're going to need those. Chests, walls. Yeah, I mean, this is going to be stuff that's going to be covered with our manually built built train. Belts. Uh, I don't know. Train stops, train track. None of this stuff we need as well. Okay, so I think, I think we're actually pretty good there. Uh, let's see, do we have any requester chests? We do. Um, let's get one right here. And you've got one, two, two items. You have one, two, three items. You have one, two, three, four, five items. And uh, do we have stack inserters? No, we don't, but we have some over here. I would just want to go ahead and do that. Get a stack of those. And we don't really need one for there. Like a yellow one would be fine for the fuel. Uh, can we copy and paste that? No, we can't. Or at least it's giving me that. Damn it. There we go. Um, you are going to be assembling machines. Production, assembling machines. Um, 50, let's do 100. Uh, and beacons. Let's do like, I don't know, 400. Seems excessive, but it will get a lot produced. Um, Okay, you are inserters, medium power poles, and substations. 50 is fine. Let's, uh, 50 is fine. And let's do like 300. Um, let's do, let's do half. Okay, so you are storage chests, you are requester chests, you are passive provider chests, you are roboports, and you are logistics bots. All right, that should be good. Let's go ahead and power this. And we're going to have to get a roboport in range. Probably want to put one down here by the storage facility, just because. A little bit of overlap there, but I think it's going to be fine. All right, and that will just uh, fill up. Uh, we That's our automated building train. We are missing... 
why are you not considered in RoboPort range? Because we forgot to put power. We can fix that real quick. All right, and that'll just load. That'll just load. All right, let's hop in our manual building train. And let's head to module modules. And I want to see if we can do something about our green circuit situation over here. Uh-oh. Um, I don't like that. Oh, you know what I did? I didn't, uh... Didn't, I didn't signal that. Uh, let's see. Blueprint. No. Um. Blueprint. We have a straight signal somewhere? Can I get a straight signal somewhere? Anywhere. Anywhere, please. Right here. That one right there. There we go. Did that fix it? Yeah, okay, yeah, I just I just didn't signal that. <laughs> My bad. Alright, uh let's continue on. Boy, I would really like that whole fix it from space stuff. That works out really well. All right, so. Get up into this mess here. I cannot see my mouse pointer. There it is. Yeah, look at those red circuits. Um, let's take a look here what we can do about this. All right, let's get rid of you and you and you and you. And let's blueprint. Like that. And go ahead and take you up like that. Okay, there's that. We took out two robo ports. Let's get those in here. Maybe put another one over here. Just expanding that a little bit. Giving it a little bit more, a little bit more building power. And probably do the same exact thing down here. Take you out, you out, you out, you out. Oh gosh, look at all those bots we had in there. Um, and grab. Oh, where'd it go? That one? No, that one. Okay, all those are down. Let's grab. It looks like we need some more beacons. We have a couple of stacks of those. We do have modules and things. Oh my gosh, I almost got hit by a train. That was close. <laughs> it's going to happen. It's going to happen one of these days. Um, it's going to happen one of these days very soon. I'm just, I'm not even looking. I'm just, just walking. Just walking. Not even looking. Okay, there are some more beacons. There are the modules. Got all of these guys in my inventory. I want them out. Alright, did that fix the problem? No, but it should increase the amount of green circuits that we're making. I don't like that they're crossing the middle there still. Then again, I didn't do anything at all to prevent that from happening. Are not working. Why are you not working? Because you don't have copper. 
We have copper right there. Oh, we're missing chests. We need chests. Okay. Boy, I'm glad I went and double-checked that. That would have been tragic. Um, that's easy. We have chests. You know, we may want to add steel chests to our other building train. Just because of this situation right here, in case I do use a little bit of a buffer. Yeah, there we go. There are some more greens being made. And now these guys are being made. Not being made, uh, not being made constantly. But you guys are. So that looks like it definitely helped with that. How is our blue circuit production? Okay, it's, it's going a lot better now. All right, so hopefully that will perform a little bit better. All right, thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. Um, I will see you in the next episode where we are probably going to do some planning on our actual real rocket production facilities. I'm pretty excited. All right, thank you for watching. See you next time.